Let's move on now. There's some positive news as well relating to electronic waste. People in Amsterdam with broken or damaged electrical devices are taking them to a cafe where they are repaired and given a second life by a team of volunteers. A team of mechanics restores the items, saving clients the money and keeping the electronics out of landfills. Take a look. It's another busy day for volunteer repairmen in Amsterdam. Every Wednesday afternoon, they come to a repair cafe to put their technical skills to good use. People bring along broken electrical devices like DIY tools and kitchen appliances. And these volunteers do their best to bring them back to life. If they can fix the broken items, it means one less item is thrown in the bin. And the owner doesn't have to shell out money for a replacement. Very important because we only save around 7,000 kilos in Amsterdam that does not end up in the landfill. Also because people with tight budgets live in this neighborhood. It's nice if things can be repaired. You can choose to put one euro in our donation pot or you might lose 60 or 100 euros for a new device. This repair session is part of a network of dozens of cafes across Amsterdam where experts try to repair old items. Chris Beerput has brought in a damaged coffee machine. He is hopeful it can be saved. The volunteer repairmen enjoy giving these old electronics a new lease of life. I'm glad we have this workshop. The device was working with. It doesn't seem okay to throw it away. So something that might not be quite right can be easily repaired without throwing it away. E-waste is a huge problem for the environment. According to a survey of almost 9,000 households across Europe, every household has an average of 74 electronic products, at least four of which are broken. The group behind the study, the Waste Electrical and Electronic Equipment Forum, wants to use October 15th, which is marked as International E-Waste Day, to raise awareness about the forgotten items languishing in the back of our cupboards or abandoned in drawers. It's great. The best thing is when you come home in the evening after a day at work, knowing that you have helped a lot of people and made people go home very happy. There are a lot of good things about that. It is good for the environment, less garbage and so on. About 80% of the things people bring in, we manage to fix. That's very satisfying for clients, but also for us as mechanics. As inflation spikes and the cost of living rises, more people are looking for ways to economize. And keeping electrical household items working for as long as possible is one way to cut spending. The International E-Waste Day encourages people to repair, reuse and recycle their electrical items. Bureau Report we on World is One. Moving on, some European countries like Greece are rapidly accelerating away from fossil fuels and towards cheaper and greener renewable electricity. The Greek electrical system has hit a new milestone after running completely on clean renewable energy for the first time. Renewable energy sources covered Greece's electricity demands for about five hours. Renewables also set a new record, reaching a peak of more than 3,100 megawatt per hour of electricity. The independent power transmission operator, which owns and operates the Greek electrical transmission system, said that the achievement will open the doors to making its energy mix greener in the coming years. Greece's accomplishment comes after a decade in which its reliance on fossil fuels has gradually declined. At the same time, as it has boosted the capacity of renewables and large hydropower plants. Greece relies on a range of sources for electricity, with none of the sources accounting for more than 50%. Earlier this year in August, natural gas and renewable sources such as wind and solar accounted for the most power in the country. Greece's system isn't the only one to have hit the 100% mark with renewables. The much larger California independent system operator also reported that it briefly achieved the same in spring. Renewable energy has an unprecedented boom in recent years. In the U.S. this year, the gains include wind power outpacing both coal and nuclear energy. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.